Okay, we're three weeks out from today. Is that correct? Three weeks. Three weeks from today. What are you feeling? Feeling strong. <laughs> no, nah, man, I feel great. Um, I've got one more, well, I guess two more PR workouts. One's going to be my bicep, tricep day to day, and then tomorrow's my shoulder day. I had planned on going up again next week, but I, I feel like I'm strong enough right now. It's, it's the strongest I've ever been on my circuits. I, I'm stronger now than I was when I pulled Dave. So I feel like I'm just going to do some blood flow the next week and a half. It's better to be 100% healthy than hit another PR because I'm already my strongest. Let's talk about your workout. You just finished doing a PR this week. Yeah. So Which I, one was that? That was what well, I did back and chest. Um, my back circuit on Monday was 250 pound country crush lap pull downs, the whole stack. Six, seven, eight, nine, 30. <clears throat> easy. Honestly, wasn't that easy? Uh, 250 seated rows. <clears throat> Two hundred straight bar pull downs. One eighty one arm rows, and then uh, the whole stack plus. I don't remember how much we added for the uh, for the bent over rows. But yeah, it's the heaviest circuit ever for back. We even arm wrestled first. Back press on. Close your thumbs. Close your hands. Go! Go! We didn't go unbroken, but I, I contribute that to end up cheating Saturday and Sunday, plus we arm wrestled beforehand, but we still did all the all the work, and we did it in a pretty reasonable time. It's great, because it's the hardest circuit we've ever known. We never trained this hard. It sucks that we didn't go unbroken. You didn't go unbroken because you got more pump from the bad food. Yeah, the bad food gave me a, a pretty, I, and I knew it that morning in my uh, wrist roll battle rope cardio circuit, I knew that the pump was pretty severe. And when I eat bad, my body uh, doesn't respond as well. So, you know, we had pizza and just junk food for two days. So uh, the pumps are pretty severe and then add the BFR to it. And uh, trying to do your heaviest circuit ever, the pump was pretty bad. A bad nutrition caused me to have more of a pump eating two, eating two days in a row bad. But and we're not doing that again. We're cheating well, next Saturday and then I'll have Sunday to recover and then we'll train Monday. I want to talk about a little problem you had during the workout. All right. So oh, you're going you're gonna to mention that? You threw a bit of a tantrum. I didn't throw a tantrum. Um, I think if I actually played for them the clip, they'll see it was a tantrum. It's not a tantrum. You um, threw the country yeah. crush into our seated row machine. This, this I did. Okay. Uh, around 15 reps in, I felt tingling in my hand where it broke last year, and it, it just pissed me off. I want you to show me where you felt tingling. Right here where my hand broke. That's right. That's what pissed me off. I started tingling back there where the metacarpal broke. So. Okay. Let's talk about when your hand broke last year. Monster Michael Todd looking to transition. Looking to rotate and press. Rotate and press. Jerry putting everything he has into this. Everything. It hurts so bad. What were you doing then? I was doing new PRs. Okay, why are the numbers so important to you? It seems like this has been a bit of a... I don't know what you say. It, it's your self-sabotaging in a bit that I've seen in a couple I mean, of different you're instances. You're just talking about me tearing my lat and tearing my pec before push guard. Push with your legs. Push with your legs. Big breath. So you know. Come on up. Come on up. Damn punch. Two. Two, come on. And why did you do that? Uh, set new PRs. How often? Every week. Every week. Yeah. Are you winning, Jerry? 
you were going up every week. Yeah. And you said you started to have pain in your hand. Yes. My hand's not breaking. I'm too strong. It's not gonna break. Dude, this is what you felt, the little tingling in the back of your hand, hand is not what you were feeling. What do you mean? It's yes, it's what I'm feeling. It's what I felt. I felt it. It's the same exact thing, but it's fine. I didn't push it far enough to hurt it. It's okay. I just felt tingling in the back of my hand where the fracture occurred. And so it pissed me off. What I'm needing you to do is give me confidence that that's not what's going it's on. It's not going to happen. Okay, so. This is not a new PR each week. This is building back up to beat my previous PR last week and then a new PR this week. And I was going to go up again next week. So, I mean, apparently I've learned something. I'm just going to finish out this week and, and do blood flow after that. My hand is fine. I'm going to beat Jerry so bad it won't even matter about my hand. People think it's going to be a war. I'm going to run through Jerry Cataret. So tell me what the rest of the week is going because you're hitting, you're going to, you feel like you need to do another PR. My previous tonight. best fat hand on hammer. Close your thumbs. Close your hands. Go! Alrighty then. You want to go on second go? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go back first on the first go. Close your thumbs. Close your hands. Go! Go! 